why some people are calling Anthony Moses a miracle man. He spent 30 days on a vent and another 20 days regaining his strength at a rehab facility. Incredible. Well, Grant Herms was there for Anthony's big reunion after 50 days away from his family. A month ago, we met Tony Moses. He spent 30 days on the ventilator, and today, after spending 50 days without his family, they reunited. That's her. It's been a long road back for 63-year-old Anthony Moses, the first COVID-19 patient to be sent to Beaumont Hospital in Farmington Hills. Anthony's battle against the virus was a difficult one. Anthony's battle against the virus was a difficult one. Spending a month on a ventilator, kidney and lung failure, and at one point, technically dying. But today, he's going home. I'm just thrilled that this day has finally come. It's been a long time coming, over 50 days, almost, almost two months since I last touched my husband. After spending so much time bedridden, Anthony could barely walk until he was moved to a rehabilitation hospital where today, family, friends, and those who took care of him waited anxiously to send him home. For his wife, Tiffany, the past five weeks have been a test of faith. Uh, I said, Lord, if you if he dies, how do you get the glory? I said, he can't get any. You can't get any glory if he passes away. Tiffany says her prayers were answered. And after waiting just six weeks, one day in 14 hours and 30 long minutes, Anthony was finally wheeled into the lobby. <laughs> Anthony credits his faith for his recovery, but also his wife, who he saw tell his story on Local 4 last month. And that really got me over the edge. It got me to where I really wanted to carry on. Had this big smile on my face. He also had a special message for those healthcare workers who saved his life. Everybody in the hospital said, you're a hero, you're a hero. <laughs> I said, I'm not the hero, why are you saying that? Then I said, no, I'm not the hero. You guys are the heroes. A trip home at long last for a man who many called a walking miracle. Anthony still has a lot of recovery to do, but this time he won't be alone. He'll be with his family. He says he wants to get back to work. He's an IT guy right now. He says he wants to become a preacher. Grant Herms, Local 4. Wow. <laughs> yeah, well, Anthony said he will never forget the doctors and nurses who helped him recover. He said he plans to visit them as soon as he's back to full health. Oh, amazing story. Yeah.